Let's do this, partner. Yeah. Seems like you're getting more used to animals. Hmm. Nope, not gonna happen. Pretty good having you around. Why? This is so Let's easy. just say I never knew anyone as honest as you when I was alive. Uh-huh. I guess I get it. Sometimes when the wind picks up around here, people end up with cuts on them. The weird thing, though, is that they don't hurt or bleed. Gotta be the work of a Kamaitachi. Isn't that the yokai that's like a weasel with sickles for hands? They're so fast, people think it's the wind, right? That's right. Makes them a real pain to catch. I would know. Hunted them as a kid. Always lost them, though. Most kids would have given up after once or twice. Why am I sensing that you're suddenly all excited? Because if we use my power, we can track it. I'm not gonna lose it this time. There's a Kamaitachi. It's not paying any attention to us. Get moving. Chase after it until it stops. Stop moving. Yes! A finally bad one. <laughs> I think you mean I bag one. You see all kinds of stuff in the forest. Not necessarily a good thing, you know. Ushino Kokumaidi, hammering a nail into a straw doll. Legend has it, if someone does it for seven days without being spotted, it'll curse the person tied to the doll. As long as that doll's around. That guy's stuck here. And on top of that, now we gotta cleanse the doll, or the area will be cursed too. Time to look for that straw doll, then. Sound of hammering. Get close. You son 
me. Perger and clean up the corruption. Back off. Why'd you curse that guy? Did he do something to you? The man mocked my birthmark. He told everyone about it and they laughed. But you didn't have to curse him, did you? Second she cursed him, she turned into a monster. That's why curses cut both ways. Time to put her out of her misery. a girl with a birthmark? No, I don't think so. Is that who cursed me? Maybe you forgot, but she sure as hell didn't. Said you made everyone laugh at her birthmark. It consumed her, and in her hatred, she cursed you. A little teasing is no reason to curse a guy. I mean, the freaking died because of that? You weren't the only victim. The curse turned her into a specter, too. Curses are a vicious cycle, so try not to hear. Hey, is she free from the curse, at least? Yeah, we sorted it out. Okay, I'm glad. Thanks. We have to find the others out there. Quite a number of children have gone missing in Shibuya lately. Apparently, they've all vanished during a game of hide and seek. Strange disappearances. Could be something caused by corruption. I just hope they all make it back safe and sound.
kids connected to the disappearances or he could be one of the victims himself good thinking either way you should look into it <laughs> he must be getting nervous by now This is... How about that? Looks like we win this round. he wasn't involved after all. So all he wanted to do was have fun. than ever. Hey, want me to teach you some new skills? The way you are now, I bet you could handle it.
talk about someone having your back. Much better. Did you actually pray? Of course. Oh, now I've done it. When you're on a second-hand shop, sometimes you find objects with a history. That's how I got cursed by that diamond. Wound up like this. I can't even rest in peace. So, where is this diamond? Sold it without realizing what it was. The customer who bought it died in an accident on her way home. I heard the diamond was laid at her gravesite. At her gravesite? Oh. That'll corrupt the whole damn cemetery. What'll happen if it's corrupted? Gonna be a lot more souls who can't pass on. Just like you. Isn't there something you can do? You have to find that diamond and cleanse it, please! Ugh. Just keeps getting better. But we can't just ignore it.
Looks like visitors are attracted to the rush. We've got to be getting closer to that time. That's all of them. The crows are going. <laughs> this must be it. There it is. Now we cleanse it. It's cleansed, but it could still happen again. Better take it with us. We're not gonna get cursed by it, are we? Away. Guess we know who owns the diamond. We got you killed. Time to move on. You don't understand. I can talk to Jules. It was languishing in that shop, just waiting for me to rescue it. No gem is simply cursed by nature. They're just highly resonant with human emotions. Human greed and envy are what corrupt them. I promise I won't do anything to corrupt it again. Just let me look after my precious diamond. Hmm. You're probably the best one for the job. I suppose you can hang on to it. Thank you for understanding. As long as it's with me, I'll never be alone. Well, that's not exactly how I expected it to end. Me neither. But at least that shopkeeper can rest in peace now. I still not We already cleansed that diamond. And I'm grateful for it. But the fact remains that I still can't pass on. Sell any other shady stuff we should know about? Hmm. Now that you mention it, I did sell those two masks. Last month I bought these masks, one male and one female. The man who sold them to me said something strange. Said that the pair of them bring good fortune as long as they're together. But that they must never be separated. Don't... Tell me you sold them separately. Well, I had two customers come in, and both of them wanted one. Must be related to those masks. Original owner might know something. Worth a shot.
back to work. Hey, about those masks you sold, any kind of secret about them we should know? Long, long ago, there was a man and a woman. They wore those masks to conceal themselves during clandestine meetings. But when their parents discovered them together, they were forced apart. The two exchanged their masks and promised one another that they would reunite in the afterlife. So... We gotta find these two masks, and get them back together. The woman who bought the female mask ought to be in this neighborhood. I am grateful for your help. about the mask. That mask is cursed. It was screaming in a woman's voice, saying, let me see him. And when I was dead, I, I don't know. Any idea where the mask is now? I threw the creepy thing in my storage shed. Stay away, it's cursed. Don't worry. The kid will take care of it. <laughs> Easy for you to say. Place like this. The mask is talking. Looks like that's it. Time to check the shed. I'm it. Please. There. This must be it. Wait, don't touch it! What the I can't get it off! Oh no. It's straining our energy. At this rate, it'll kill us! Quick, find the other mask! It's the only way to break the curse! Oh, oh, oh. Hey, we did it now! 
bring you to him. Enough! <laughs> Stupid masks almost took us out. They just wanted to be with the one they loved. You got the mask back together? That's great! Look, thank you. Now I can finally pass on. It was good of you to reunite those two masks. Fortune will smile on you both. Don't give up! It's not that bad! 
Did you actually pray? Of course. You boys mind lending me a hand with something? And here we go. There's a place I need you to check out. It might not have anything to do with the current situation, but... We haven't got time for this. Fair enough. So, where is it then? You're gonna help? Kid's gonna make us either way. So out with it. He's got good instincts. What do you need us to check out? Thanks, I really appreciate it. Hey, there's a girl. That's... She... disappeared. Follow her psychic trail. Yes. Let's keep watching.
Guessing you don't come out here that often. Huh? I come here all the time. There's this Chinese place I've been going to since I was a kid. Something over there. Shit! They're everywhere. here and what was up with that girl Rinko's department let's get back to her good news you now saved over 50,000 spirits that's enough of them to fill a stadium just hear them cheering you on in the stands. So how'd it go? You find anything? The only thing we found was this voice recorder. I see. Saw Erica. But she disappeared quick. Where was that place? That was where Erica found her first stray cat. It was our emergency meeting point if anything bad ever happened. I was hoping that I could figure out what she was doing during the fight. I haven't seen her since we got separated. It's all right. Sorry. To send you two out for nothing. Let us know if anything else comes up. I just might take you up on that. <laughs> Thanks.
to heal up first. Trying cleansed. That should clear the fog. And on we go. If you can't avoid the hit. Our money's worth. We will. I hope. I never gonna hear that nice and music. There's a piano school in this neighborhood. Every night you can hear piano music, even though there's no one there. It was really nice and soothing to listen to at first, you know. After a while, the music just got like super creepy. It's kind of got me worried. Pretty common kind of story. Still, a literal change in tune, huh? Could be the music itself has gotten corrupted somehow. Hey, I'm actually a pretty charitable guy. Am I never gonna hear that nice music again? Music? Who was it? A piano school. The music's coming from there. You think they were drawn by the corrupt music? <laughs> Get in there and stop this recital once and for all. 
music stopped. There's nobody here. Let's look around. Kid be the one playing the music? I think that was Moonlight Sonata we heard before. What do you expect? Child Prodigy is more interesting than some old guy. this hey start it up again who are you two were you the one playing that piano playing is fine but you're disturbing the whole neighborhood i'm sorry i didn't mean to disturb anyone Why do you think she got worse? It's not her. It's the music itself that's corrupted. We have to find out why. That's the question. That portrait is... It responded. It's a portrait of Giovanni. It's the musician from the magazine. Bet it's him that's causing the corruption. Yeah. He resents how much the girl resembles his own pupil, and he's jealous. I shall not lose to some vaunted prodigy. My skills are far superior! Sabotaging a kid? Now that's pathetic. Adults are supposed to be there for kids, help them. Everything's okay now. You should be able to play Moonlight Sonata again. Oh, thank you so much! Sweet little tune. I didn't know you had any taste. Well, now you do. Bad we won't hear her again. Yeah. He must be getting nervous by now. I heard it. The music's like normal. Ah, so peaceful.
That giant seems to be guarding the tower. Yeah, that's a problem. Good. On to the next. Hero thing is hard work. Huh. We're getting closer. We'll just have to keep this up. Sliding doors look awfully bare. They weren't always like this. They used to depict a great dragon. They say that long ago, there was a samurai who had lost many friends in battle. He mixed their blood with ink and painted a great dragon in their honor. But unfortunately, it came that this dragon brought great disaster upon the land. The blood of the dead probably corrupted the ink. Those friends of his must have had some serious lingering grudges. The head priest at the time tried to burn the sliding door to ash. But the dragon leapt out and dove into... A dragon den. A place with abundant chi. They say that it vanished into the dragon veins, invisible channels of energy. The dragon flew out of the painting? Come on. Well, if the ink was corrupted, it could. Dragon veins and dragon dens. Let's search the area. If we find them... Maybe we'll find our dragon. KK, over there!
It's moving along the dragon veins. Try to follow it to its den. So that's a dragon den. All right, let's seal it. Wait up! Must have run off to another den. Gotta seal that too. Then it'll have nowhere to run, and no choice but to face us. Still more dens nearby. So just seal up any we find. Got it. places to go. Only one thing left to do. Now, time for you to head home. Let's go back to the temple. Check on that sliding door.
cleanse the dragon's corruption. Now, you can finally put those souls to rest. You have my deepest thanks. With this, the disaster should finally subside. You know, it's actually a pretty cool painting. Huh. Feels like it could jump right out. Oh, come on. You know what I mean. That's good. Now to help more. do then? Simple. We cut straight through. I'll lead the way. Come on. Cut through the fog? Can we really just do that? Don't worry. Rinko and the others came up with a way to do it. Just have to hope it works. You 
use it well, kid. Yosuke, right? We already played with you. Yeah? Well, I gotta play more. So come on, play with me. Kids weirdly determined. Guess we can go a little more. Let's go! Okay, I'll head somewhere inside the shrine. Come find me. It's hard work. Well, it could be worse. Yeah, I'll take it. Bye. Keep searching. Look for a key. It can't be far.
that's the shrine key. Time to end this game. Go. You think this has got something to do with the vanishings, KK? Could be. Or maybe he just got bored and left. Either way, we're not playing his game. Better watch your step, or you're gonna trip and fall. Strange woman, maybe a Rokurokabi. So, what do you think about this place? Feels like I'm in a movie or something. Yeah, young people don't venture out here much. Focus on the Rokurokabi. Not gonna find her here. She's trying to lure us. Don't fall for it. It's a yokai. What the hell is that? Nowhere left for you to hide. Sorry. We need to borrow your power. We'll take good care of it.
save us. Someone Your call. Save. are corrupted? That's my hunch. But two, probably connected by underground water veins. That means even if we cleanse one well, it'll just get corrupted again right away. We'll have to cleanse them both. Fast. It's a race against the clock, then. Cleanse that well. Okay, that's one well down. It'll only be a few minutes before it's corrupted again. We've got to get to the other well. Cleanse that well. Whew. Looks like we made it. That's the way. Well water is safe now, sir. Thank you. Now my grandchildren can always have fresh well water.
say we all have three people who look like us. It was a doppelganger. I heard you die if you meet one. It's worse than that. It'll also follow you all over the afterlife. Hold on. I'll answer the phone and see what happens. You can't run from me. Who is this? And what do you want? Just wait. I'll see you soon. Something's coming. Tell them apart. How do I tell them apart? Good kid. Why are you getting in my way? There are beings just like me inside you, too. Would you like to meet them? No thanks, lady. One of me is all the world needs. Oh, 
Okay now. I don't have to keep running. That's right. She won't come after you anymore. Cherry blossoms. Trees corrupted. Looks like we've got company. Time to rumble. Good work. Let's cleanse the tree.
Now that's how cherry blossoms should look. Just add beer and a picnic blanket. Four of us, I knew we shouldn't have ever messed with that thing. What happened to you? Workers on this side have been dropping like flies. There were always rumors about this place. But the boss just wasn't having it. <sighs> Never should have come here. Almost sounds like they disturbed something living here. tried to demolish it. Made him angry. Either way, I guess we'd better summon him for questioning. Wait. You're not seriously saying... Gotta smash the stone! Do it! Seriously? Fools! I didn't think any of you dogs remained! Huh. That worked. Didn't even need to break it. You dare bring chaos upon my manor once more! What the... Did we go back in time? Guess this used to be an old samurai manor. Back when they had memorial stones. Something terrible must have happened here. Take it down. It's the only way to get rid of the grudge. But you got the wrong guy. We came here to release you from your pain. <laughs> so. 
So his grudge turned him into a specter because someone betrayed him? More than likely someone he trusted. A stab in the back never really heals, that's for sure. In there. Head for the back. Great. More of these things. Of all the times. Can we get the power back on? Yeah. Breaker should be over past that flashlight. By using spectral vision, never know what we might find. making things harder for us. I feel like I could take on the world. Take a look. That was Rinko's custom ride. Damn. But what's custom about it? Got some kind of anti-spirit tech, from what I heard. In theory, it ought to get us through the fog. How about in reality? Quiet. Give me a sec. It won't even start. Of course not. There's no gas in it. Plus, the custom turbocharger is busted. We'll need a replacement turbine wheel to get it running again. The real problem's the fragrant underworld oil. The... what? This is no ordinary bike. It's got the power to cut right through that fog. But to do that, it needs special oil from the other side. And we're fresh out. Okay. So how do we get some? Dunno. You... No. <sighs> 
If you don't know, then what are we supposed to do? Better get that. Bet someone's gonna force their help on us. I didn't have all day to wait for you to pick up. So I rigged this phone to ring periodically and play back a recording. No need to talk, just listen to my instructions. That voice... it's Ed. You're in the garage, which means you're trying to use Rinko's motorbike. And now, you don't know where to find the necessary fragrant underworld oil. I've told you before, KK, but I'm sure you'll have forgotten, am I right? Smart guy. Kiss my ass. You can find the oil in places where the underworld's interference is especially potent. Anywhere you can see it spilling over into our world. This should be readily apparent. Now get searching. Signing off. Any idea where to look? Not yet. Let's find a good vantage point, scope out the area. Around here, bet. This bed might. That's the Rinko I know. Never holds back. Would a secondhand shop really deal in something like that? Lots of things end up on their shelves. Most folks wouldn't recognize it. If it's that corrupted, definitely worth checking out. So, Ed, does he usually communicate with recordings like that? Yeah, pretty much. Sometimes he'll go a week or more without saying a word in person. One time I wanted to make him talk, so I told him there was a ninja hiding behind him. And did that... work? Nope. But later he sent me a 20-minute recording of ninja facts. Bike of Rinkos has some serious mods on it, huh? Yeah, those guys are all into that kind of thing. Rinko's really particular. Not just with the bike, either. One time she even built her own cleaning robot. That was mainly because she died before she picked up a broom, though. <laughs>